So let me ask you something. Most people never think about this. Is your phone carrier protecting you or spying on you? Because the big guys, AT&T, Verizon, T-Mobile, have made headlines again and again for data breaches and selling your information like it's Black Friday for data brokers. Meanwhile, you're over here just trying to watch camping videos and watch memes. And here's the wild part. Even if you use VPNs, encrypted messaging apps, uh, private browsers, all of that protects the apps not the network underneath. Attacks like SIM swaps, location tracking, voicemail hacks, metadata leaks, all that happens below the apps where you can't see it and can't stop it. Today, I wanna show you something a little different. This is in the category of urban survival, a carrier that actually protects you at the root. It's called CAPE, and it's built by experts in telecom, cybersecurity, and national security. And once you understand how it works, you'll never look at your carrier the same way again. So here's the problem. Traditional carriers aren't just phone companies, they're ISP conglomerates whose business model is collect every detail about your life, sell it, lose it in a massive data breach, and repeat the process. Everything you do on your phone, locations, calls, browsing, metadata, it gets logged, stored and then shipped off to advertisers, data brokers, and sometimes whoever breaks into the systems that week. And because the underlying network protocols are ancient, attackers can exploit them to track your location, to intercept calls and texts, to steal authentication codes, to hijack your phone number, and that's where CAPE enters as the solution. CAPE is what happens when telecom engineers and cybersecurity people say, what if we built a carrier that's secure on purpose? Founded in 2022, CAPE is a secure mobile carrier with premium nationwide coverage, just like the big guys, but built from the ground up with privacy and security as first principles. We're talking features like minimal data collection, SIM swap protection, enhanced signaling protection, encrypted voicemail, and private payment. And here's the cool part. CAPE isn't a light MVNO like Mint. It's a heavy MVNO, meaning they lease tower access, but they run their own mobile core and their own SIMs. That's the command center for the whole network. Owning it's the only way to truly secure it, and CAPE is the only privacy carrier in the country that does this. Can I say that again? It's the only privacy carrier in the country that does this. This isn't the easy way, but it's the only way to build one that actually protects you. Traditional carriers want your entire life story just to give you a phone number, your name, address, social security number, your credit check. CAPE's sign-up process is more like, hey, you got a phone? Cool, here's the service. They don't ask for your name, your social security number, or your address. They collect the bare minimum to get you online, and even that's auto-deleted as soon as possible. They can't lose data they don't collect, they can't sell data they don't collect, and they don't want your personal identity. That's kind of refreshing, isn't it? Most SIM swaps happen because humans are involved. Someone calls your carrier, pretends to be you, and boom, your number is moved to their phone. CAPE removes humans from the loop entirely. During sign up, you get a 24 word phrase, your private key that you control. This phrase is the only way to move your number to another device or a carrier, not a rep, not a manager, not Todd from the call center. It works like a crypto wallet for your phone number. No one can move it without your phrase, not even CAPE. So that's something you definitely wanna write down and put in a lockbox somewhere. Legacy networks use an outdated protocol like SS7 that allow attackers to track you or intercept your calls. CAPE built a proprietary signaling proxy that checks whether your device's physical location matches the network it's trying to connect to. If anything looks off, it's blocked instantly. Most voicemail systems are ancient and unencrypted, basically an unlocked diary. CAPE encrypts your voicemails the moment they arrive. Only your device can decrypt them, not CAPE, not attackers, not anyone breaking into a server. If someone tries to snoop, all they get is scrambled sadness. Most carriers tie your billing info directly to your identity. CAPE doesn't ask for your name or your address when you pay, just your card number and your zip code. Your card is tokenized, meaning CAPE never stores it and can't read it. They keep your zip code for tax rules, but it's not linked to your account. Your identity stays yours. 
what a concept. Here's my favorite part. Cape works on almost any modern phone. If your phone takes a SIM card, Cape fits. If it supports eSIM, activation is instant. And if you've got a dual SIM phone, you can run Cape as your private second line. So you keep your regular number on SIM 1 and put Cape on SIM 2. Same phone, same apps, but two lines, and zero tracking. It's perfect for separating your work from your personal life. No need for two phones, just one phone, two identities, and more privacy. Cape's tech has been vetted by heavy hitters in cybersecurity like Dane Stuckey from OpenAI, Dmitry Aplerovich, co-founder of CrowdStrike. Cape also partners with Proton. They support the Electronic Frontier Foundation. They donate to Graphene OS and just had Obscura named to Time's Best Inventions of 2025. They also have a referral program. You get 10 referrals and your plan is free forever, which is probably the least creepy carrier incentive I've ever seen. So here's the bottom line. Most carriers make money off your data. Cape makes money by protecting it. Premium coverage, heavy duty security, a mobile core that they actually own, and absolutely none of the creepy, we're totally not tracking you energy. Cape is what a modern carrier should be. Fast, private, secure, and not obsessed with your personal information. If you wanna try it, I've got a promo code for 33% off for six months. And if you want me to test more privacy gear or secure tech like this, just let me know in the comments. Thanks for watching and I'll see you later.